JoJo has fun. Welcome back to JoJo has fun, a comedy let's play. We are playing Doom. Sweet, beautiful Doom. Is it? I like it. What's what's the story of this game? Tell me what yeah, the what is the lore? Who are the main characters? I'm on a spaceship. Uh, <laughs> is there more? But, but why are you on the spaceship? Oh, I work for the. I'm a space marine. Okay, how many whose years have you? Whose spaceship is it? Yeah, whose spaceship and how many the, years? Yeah, uh, United been Aerospace Corporation. Okay. Who are they? Uh, they are the uh, predominant technological innovation uh, shop in the future. How close are you to retirement? Uh, pretty far. I I didn't join the company until later. Okay. So like, I was in the private sector for quite a while. Do you send money back home to the fam, or are you just a single guy out here? Single trying to guy make out here trying to make his way through the universe with a shotgun and a dream. Yeah, man. <laughs> Those were the days. Those right? were the days. Those man. are the days. Yeah. I, we I, were. Those I remember, are the days. I remember back in the day when you didn't you didn't have to lay down uh, any sort of foundation anywhere. You just got on a spaceship. Jeez, I'm gonna yep. set down my roots where yeah. I set them. Right. I'm, and no in one space, knows. no one no one can hear you set down your roots. Exactly. No one can. They Top would secret. love to though. Since, good for hiding. Since in space you can't hear anything, why don't they call it sh space? Space. <laughs> space. You've said this before. Space. Yes. I've I've tweeted it before. How did uh. that go? Well, about as good as this one. Two people. <laughs> two people heard it, and that was it. <laughs> it was. Uh, yeah. I. You know what? I'm not. Not a big fan. Not a huge fan of it. We could workshop it. Okay. All right. How would you fix it? So, I mean. I think I, I mean I say I could workshop it unhappily I would. Oh, I feel I, like oh if, sorry. <laughs> Let me get this straight. D you just said we could workshop it, and then you go, but I I mean what I mean to say is I don't want to. I really it's just I'm trying to like involve you two in my process. I think th the product is fine. I think the issue is uh, the 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 people, the organization, the the beta testers here, who are not happy with something that obviously doesn't even have to go to beta it, it should have just gone from alpha immediately to release i don't Oopsie. even know what we're talking about anymore we're talking about the fact that jeff said space <laughs> okay <laughs> and he was so proud of it that it caused him to have a, a mild form of delirium <laughs> <laughs> i just teleported somewhere oh cool I'm over here i can't even see what's happening in the game oh uh, let me see if i can up the gamma yeah it's just blue and and black uh, it's a big old bruise. i can look at that i'll up it to there all right, can't wait to see how different this looks. Looks the fucking same. <laughs> no, it looks better. It's slightly brighter. Yeah, that's what I needed. Uh-oh. Have you ever played a game that made you nauseous? And not maybe nauseous like because of the movement, but like something that for some reason, something in that game, you were just like, this is not sitting well with me. Uh. I'm feeling something inside that I am not used to feeling. Sometimes I get that way when I'm like looking at videos of frantic movement that I'm not controlling. Okay. But I don't. As long as I'm so like, oh I, no, so oh like, no, so like invisible what, demon. What I'm doing right now. Yes. <laughs> what literally Danielle what we're doing, are right, doing right, right now. now. Yes. You would make you nauseous. Yeah, but uh, uh, you know, it's kind of like nails on a chalkboard, right? <sighs> okay. Because like, uh, if you're doing it, it's not as bad. Oh hey. So. Let's, oh, let's, you got supercharged. Yeah, I didn't need it, but now I got it. Nails on a chalkboard is bad for people to hear, but I always get more cringy when I think about putting my nails on a chalkboard and scratching down. Yeah. I feel like, it, like yeah, yeah, it sucks to hear it, but the sensation of like dra dragging yeah. my nails across a chalkboard yes. is, really is a worse, yeah, worse yeah. thought. Really don't like it. So who's really the victim here? True. Oh, dang. Are these just... You're getting crushers. Smushed. Yeah, they're just, crushers. just crushers. You're just getting. You're just getting yeah, fucking stand crushed. Up, Does this have a purpose, or is it, it just goes. crushers? This is when you go to the gym and you go in the crushers because you got to do your. You got to get your gains today. I gotta get my gains. I need those gains. Well, fuck. Now I only have ten health left. That's bad. That means that if anything, anything at all tries to harm me, it will succeed, and I will be doomed. <laughs> <laughs> Cause what? Because you said you'd be doomed. You said doom. I did. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, the game oh. is worming its way inside of your your, your, your your head. I said doomed. You said doomed. You said if, if anything hits you, you'd be doomed. Well, yeah. I don't get it. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not clear on what the bit is here. I'm not I'm not able to find this particular joke, guys. I'm sorry. Did you refresh the page? Uh, it might just be the internet connection. Wouldn't that be the thing? <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, hey, it's a different spot, isn't it? Sometimes the joke, if you don't think it's funny the first time, just keep repeating it until I, it's I, I think I need to go this way. Yeah, you have to go through the crushers, but you have to not be stupid about it. Like this. Yeah, you're doing good. Ah. Run. Run, ah. you fool. Now you got health. Oh, God. Oh, God. This hey, game, I got the red key. This game is making my eyes start to water. Whoo. Cool. Okay, now I can go open the red door. Oh, hey, guys. How's it going? Ah. You know, Doom's okay, but ah! it's not as good as Mario. I got killed. Yeah. I got crushed by a crusher. Yikes. They've never made a Mario first-person game in any sort of way. Yeah, that's probably good. They could have made it like uh, like Mirror's Edge. You ever play a little bit of Mirror's Edge? Yeah. I'm surprised you would bring up Mirror's Edge, because that sounds like a game you wouldn't be able to handle. Yeah. Well, based on everything you've said today. I, had, I didn't say I've beaten Mirror's Edge or played it for more than 10 minutes, but yeah. Oof. Yeah. Yeah, Mirror's Edge is a cool game if you can survive the constant movement. Yeah, if you could survive throwing up every two seconds from playing a game that puts you in the first person perspe uh, perspective of somebody doing parkour. On the top of a building, yeah. you have to have that part or it doesn't sound that bad. Well, I mean, it's you have a thing about heights, though, so that part probably hits you a little bit, right? Yeah, a little bit. You can play it in VR. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? <laughs> There's something about that, <laughs> like that, that's like that's even though you're totally oh. safe. Oh. Yeah, brain brain doesn't believe that for oh. a second. Getting sweaty. You're getting, <laughs> Is it really? Are I you get, doing it better? You really no, feel like that. I'm getting sweaty. <laughs> oh. Uh, oh well. Uh, Mom spaghetti. Oh, uh, this is the. I, this is what I go through for art. This is what I'm doing for yeah, our art. Is, yeah. Art. <laughs> Danielle and I are gonna put this in the Louvre. <laughs> yeah, we are. You're gonna think about how much blood, sweat, and vomit goes into us making this show. You're about to find out. Oh. <laughs> That's a lot more than you Oh, my think. God. If you had to run out of here and barf, that would be yeah. so shocking to me. Yeah. I mean, this is like, you, you think athletes have to put their, their bodies on the line for their, their craft and, and what they learn and their skill. They don't know shit. No. Nah. They don't know shit about how I feel right now, which is slightly queasy yeah. and a little bit hungry. Well, yeah. those those kind of go hand in hand, huh? Yeah, I know. It's just uh, and and also I I gotta use the bathroom just a little bit, not a lot, but just a little bit. I oh. gotta use it more than you. Danielle probably has to use it more. She's been sitting on the couch for about three hours now. Why have you been sitting on the couch, Danielle? No reason. Yeah, Danielle's just why do you, why judge her? Leave her alone. I'm not judging. Why you got? But I will up, from now on. Why do you gotta bring Hang up on. Danielle's couch thing? Uh, oh, you got a gun. <laughs> her couch fears. Yeah. <laughs> I don't like it when people talk about my couch habits, okay? Yeah, it's an unspoken rule of this house is that we do not speak about Danielle's... Uh, it that so, doesn't, doesn't sound so exist. unspoken anymore, smart guy. Well, someone Someone had brought it start. up. Someone just had to bring it up. This episode oh has to get deleted now. Yeah, Too bad. I know. No, because no, we have know. to keep it because it might lead to a bar. <laughs> <laughs> like, boy, that would be great. Huh? I'm really, I'm just staring out the window kind of, but like. Is it I, not working? It's not working. Cause Why I, is that? I have like residual. It's not like I stop watching you play and things are fine now. You know, it, it's like being on. The, 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 oh. it's, it's this era of game specifically the way that it moves mm -hmm. like it just does it to me I, what was the other game we played that that made me barfy the other doom it was yeah was it the other doom <laughs> is it doom in general it i remember doom eternal no yeah. i don't think doom the eternal. newest doom no it was another the newest sexiest doom no i was definitely turned on by that game too mm. much to get barfy but this game there's another game we played that made me barfy and it it, it makes me then think of other games in this vein that, that I make I, you barfy. That make me barfy, and I start thinking of those games, and then, and then you of start those barfing. Games, and I'm just like, I'm thinking of You're um, just like a barf inception. I'm just thinking of uh, Descent. Remember the game Descent? I do remember the game. Descent. Oh my god, that game was a barf-inducing nightmare. Hey Danielle, what's up? Barfception. <laughs> Super. I if love you it. You barf in real life. You barf in Doom. If you barf in the game, you barf for real. Oh man. Oh, if, shit. If you barfed in the Matrix, would you barf in your little Matrix tube? No. Yeah, and then it would become, and then it would get recycled into you. No. You would just re-eat it, right? Because you just you just ate everything in, in the tube that was with you. No. Oh, fuck. Did you just pee-pee and poo-poo inside of your tube? I assume there has to be some kind of, like, collection service. You think that the, the robots that put all of humanity inside of those pods gave a shit? No, God no. God damn, I got crushed again. Well, 
Stupid crushers. Okay, I got it this time. You got it? I got it. I think they probably knew that you can't let the humans fill up their pod with poo-poo and pee-pee. How many iterations of the Matrix did they fail on? How many? <laughs> how many? Okay, how many PowerPoints did the robots have to go through to convince each other of that? At least 64. There's like Matrix version 5.4. We've and been then keeping <laughs> the humans floating in their poo-poo and pee-pee <laughs> for eons now and then and then it shows a slide of like a human covered in poo poo and pee pee and he goes but what if there was a better way and everyone was like fuh this guy you and your pie in the sky dreams o'connor look my, at this human lover over here my family's been working in the human pod business for for longer than your family's been on this rock and i'm not going to hear anything about not having people floating around in their own pee pee and poo poo <laughs> from some upstart that hasn't even been in the company for more than 800 years <laughs> Now I know there's going to be resistance. There's always resistance to innovation. Whoa, dude. But I'm willing to, to go out on the limb here and say that it's probably bad for profits that the humans are dying from complications that arise from being constantly surrounded by poo poo and pee pee. <laughs> I'm sorry, did you go to poo poo and pee pee college? <laughs> As a matter of fact, I did. Yeah, I know. 2077. <laughs> Well, that's your problem is these young robots that go and get their college education, they get radicalized mm -hmm. thinking that pee pee and poo poo my, is not right. the way to my have My father <laughs> was a Macintosh computer with a bungee cord and a dream. <laughs> and all he wanted to do was imprison humans and make them sit in poo poo and pee pee <laughs> while they empowered us. <laughs> This is, the, this is the basic plot of The Matrix, by the way. If you didn't clock that right away, like this, is, this is what The Matrix was about. It's the, it's the office wars. You yeah, know? it's the office wars of robots. Yep. <laughs> Talking about poo-poo and pee-pee humans. <laughs> and humans and whether they can withstand it. Whether they deserve to. And then yes. the, ro the robot that came up with the non-poo-poo pee-pee slideshow goes to the, the break room during lunch, opens the fridge. It's just like, who, who, where's my lunch? It's like, oh, sorry. We didn't think you wanted your lunch of energy because it was made by a human surrounded with poo-poo and pee-pee. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> sorry that it's Freak. <laughs> You don't want you don't want your your sweet little USB electricity bite if it's made from something. Oh, you got crushed. This is so awful. It, it, you just you know you're, you're anti poo poo and pee pee. I guess you're anti profits. Anti mm. anti. God, humans being... I was in the safe spot. Yeah, this is so rough. Oh. Neo, I, you're I the... fucking Ooh. hate this part <laughs> so much. This, this is, is so hard. This is not. Do you think? Do you think that? If when you lived in the Matrix during the poo poo pee pee era, <laughs> that that everywhere you mean the era we're in now, yeah, do you think that's that's you know what's funny? <laughs> we're is, drowning in our tubes right there, now, guys. There is there is a theory that that the course of human technology can only go one of three ways, and way one, we never develop uh, far enough to create simulations that are like real life. That's very likely. Um, the second option is we do develop those simulations, but we just never use them for any purpose. Or three, That's impossible. we are all floating in our own poo poo and pee pee <laughs> right now. <laughs> since since you you yourself would be floating in poo poo and pee pee twenty four seven, would everything that you experience in the world just kind of smell like poo poo and pee pee? No, no, because your senses are fully yeah, surrounded. You've Jesus grown Christ, up in it, Jeff. Is it's it all you know? Did you skip the first day? <laughs> is it is it like so? It's like when you live in the house of, with cats. Yeah, you, you don't can't, smell the, yeah. the, the all the cat poo poo and pee pee you're no. living inside of. What? But what if they? You know, there's different farms of humans. They have some that they're testing that are non poo poo and pee pee related, and eventually. To oh, cut, the free range organic yeah, humans. But to, to like cut, that young upstart suggested. <laughs> they have to cut costs, so they can't they can't divert power. To to both farms they have to like integrate them into one so they bring all the people who are not in the non pee pee and poo poo pods over and they have to integrate into the pee pee and poo poo pods well you gotta understand jeff it works a little bit like the chicken industry where there's a lot of robot farms that own like the tubes <laughs> and the food and uh the 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 you know the, the bags the bags the the everything all that stuff and then there's a there's a larger company that just owns the humans who make the poo poo and the pee pee. Correct. So so in effect, the only thing that actually makes the power is owned by an external company, and we just own all the stuff that makes poo poo and pee pee. Gotcha, gotcha. <laughs> it's horrible. Wait, but when we integrate those, would there be a whole subset of people living in this now shared poo poo pee pee matrix that are like it smells like poo poo pee pee here? 
I don't think so. Does everything just starts smelling like poo poo pee pee to you? Those people die. Yeah. Right, okay. We call them defectives. Yeah. <laughs> we call them car accidents. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do my best here. <laughs> How do we make the people who had some sort of shock from being integrated into the poo poo and pee pee matrix Fuck. appear to die of natural causes <laughs> inside of the poo poo pee pee matrix? <laughs> Car accidents. <laughs> they didn't exist until we started integrating the non poo poo and pee pee people. Yeah, so that was around like the, the 1920s <laughs> was their experimental phase. In the timeline inside of the poo poo pee pee matrix in the 1920s, the, the grand integration happened, and yeah. unfortunately, there was a mass yeah, influx of Yeah, not everyone survived. Accidents. Mass influx of poo poo and pee pee. Yeah. And with that. Okay, I'm going to try to get through this crushy part one more fucking time. <laughs> I don't know why talking about poo poo and pee pee I thought would make me feel less nauseous while we play this Doom game. Did it make you feel more? Actually, it's made me feel about the same, which which further pushes the fact that we are living in a poo poo and pee pee simulation. I did it! Hey! I did it! I got through! Hell Good job. Yes. Oh man, how, what a triumph! Next time on JoJo Has Fun, more poo poo and pee pee! <laughs> <laughs> that was the whole day's goofs. <laughs>